Session 2014 ended on time, on the 60th day, and for the first time in about five years, a special session is not looming, at least not for now. 2014 will be remembered for being unmemorable. A record low number of bills passed, mostly non-controversial policy bills, including a record small supplemental operating and transportation budget. Session will also be remembered for what didn't pass. Most significant for us would be a transportation revenue bill, which could be the reason for a special session after this year's general elections. Our goal this year was to obtain and provide the contract negotiators with commitments and insurances that money would be available for the 2015-17 biennium to fund salary increases agreed to in the next contract. I believe we accomplished that. Several bills were introduced that would have created a funding source. Those bills had a number of House and Senate sponsors, while all of them depended on the passage of a transportation revenue package. The very discussion surrounding the no less than three transportation revenue bills very publicly included trooper salaries, which resulted in a House and Senate Transportation Committee chair sending a message to the governor that salary increases would be funded. All of this plus more will be laid on the table during the collective bargaining process which is underway right now and must be completed by October in order to be included in the governor's request budget to be delivered to the legislature in 2015. That will be the biennial budget that begins July 1st, 2015. There is good reason to believe that this bargaining session will end with good results. We'll keep you posted.